Tell us about this source of yours, the one who calls himself Anonymous. He texted me out of the blue. I know you find people better than I know Anonymous. Do you realize how much trouble you've caused? Oh, I'm just getting started. Earlier, at Trail's End in Cypress Knee, another death investigation. Normally, I'd never bring Reggie to a scene with a dead body. It's my night with him, though. And I'm a reporter. This is my job. Just hope... I also hope it doesn't scar him. Is that man really dead, Daddy? Don't touch anything. Wait here while I talk to Ozzy. Okay, but then ice cream. You promised. Evening, Jack. Hey, Ozzy, tell me the news. Mr. Swayhill here tried to bore a hole in his engine block with a 22 caliber pistol. Ricochet right through the left eye. Any witnesses? Just his pit bull shovel head. Dog ain't saying much. Anything else? About Swayhill, no. But I was curious. What brought you back to Cypress Knee? I figured you'd be on to much bigger things. I pissed off the wrong people. Hang on a second there, Jack. Sounds like we got another dangler at Chief Roadsides. Someone famous. Might be Bieber. Jackson Lawrence Bellet, you brought our son to a crime scene? Get off my ass, Tamara. Don't take that tone with me, Jack. I'll get- Don't push me too far. I've got limits. Yeah, right. We're better than this, Tam. If you want to win, you win. I just want- Not sure that's a good idea. Try to take him if you want. Truth's going to win out this time. Whatever, Jack. You've turned into such a disappointment. I keep hoping you'll turn it around. Maybe not for me, but for your son. Speaking of Reggie, I've got to check out this other dead body call over at Chief Roadsides. It's your night with him. I've got clients here looking at mobile home rental options. I can only imagine how much that taxes your vast real estate expertise. Fine. You'll owe me. That never changes. <laughs>